took off from Joint Base Charleston on a 20 hour direct delivery uh, airborne assault into uh, Anderson Airfield here in Guam. Uh, during that 21 hours, uh, we went over TLPs with the paratroopers and the bird and reviewed the plan. Uh, and then because we had in-flight communications, both birds were able to talk to each other as well as the uh, unit on the ground to get real-time updates uh, for both the weather and the enemy situation for the following mission, which we're about to execute right now. It's nice to get into uh, an airfield that we're unfamiliar with. You know, most of the paratroopers behind me have jumped into Holland drop zone and Sicily drop zone, you know, 10, 20, 30 times, and they're very familiar with it. Dropping into an unknown drop zone uh, kind of helps us re-blue and sharpen our skills uh, once we get on the ground to organize and uh, move off the drop zone as quick as we can. It demonstrates to our junior paratroopers and our junior leaders that, you know, the 82nd Airborne is uh, America's emergency response force. And getting out of North Carolina to anywhere in the world in uh, 18 hours to a direct delivery uh, is something that we need to stay proficient on and it proved to the, them, uh, as well as uh, senior leaders who haven't done this before, that it's a mission we uh, can and should execute uh, at the drop of a hat.